Welcome back. Yes, sir. So, buy in or sell in. Howdy, viewers. Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, doing another Red Dead Redemption 2 video. I posted a few videos about master hunting advice. Now I'm going to post a video about advice on saddles. And if you're just playing the game and you're not really into getting deeply into playing, it probably doesn't matter what saddle you use. But if you're really into playing the game and playing it right, saddles are very important in regards to your horse. And you can buy some decent saddles. I believe the Gerdon Vaccaro saddle improved at $85 gives you the best overall stats for a purchased saddle. But in this case, if you are hunting, and hunting is an extremely important part of this game as far as providing food for your camp, etc. But the skins, hides of the animals are very important for crafting. And you can craft better saddles. And I'm going to show you the saddles that um, I've crafted so far. You need perfect pelts for these animals. And right now, an alligator is being skinned. The pelt is not perfect, but if Arthur got a perfect alligator pelt, and I'm going to show you, I eventually, hunting, Arthur did get a perfect pelt, and craft a saddle out of it. Now you see in the lower right corner, there's three stars next to the American alligator. That means it's a perfect pelt. If you don't see three stars when you're hunting, yeah, don't bother shooting the animal unless you need the meat. Otherwise, be very careful when you hunt the animal because even with three stars, you use the wrong weapon, you can destroy the pelt. Perfect alligator skin. Now I'm going to take it back to the trapper and craft a saddle. Now the perfect alligator pelt will allow you to purchase a alligator ranch cutter saddle. I've already got two or three more, cougar, boar, and panther. Now those saddles give you a much better advantage than your garden variety purchased saddles. Once you craft the saddles, you go to the, um, whatchamacallit, stable, and you can change saddles that you've already had made and improve your horse. Now that I'm at the stable, I can take a look at my saddles and decide which one is better. Uh, you go down to tack and services and equipment and you go to saddles. There are these saddles you can buy, but you go to pre-purchased saddles and you look, boar mother saddle. It brings down core drain. It's already lower. And you look at the stats, they're lower than the saddle I already have, even the alligator one. And yeah, I'm not going to put those on my horse for, I mean, they're improving certain things, but they're reducing other things, and you get to be a trade-off. But the best one, I mean, right now I have the Cougar saddle on. The Panther saddle, though, is probably the best. And you look at that, it gives negative 20 core drain, negative 26 core drain, 50 drain rate. Yeah, overall, it improves the horse dramatically. It gives the horse more stamina, um, longer stamina in a sense, and it also improves the horse speed. 
these crafted saddles are so much better than your purchased saddles. I would recommend anyone go out, hunt, get a perfect pelt, and make a better saddle because it's that much more important for your horse and for gameplay. Like I said, you can purchase the Gurdon Vaquero saddle improved for $85, but it's nowhere as good as a crafted saddle. If you found this advice, informative hit the thumbs up button feel free to leave a comment hopefully this improves your game if you like this type of video i post four video game related videos a week plus some shorts hit the subscribe button and bell icon and you won't miss out as always i'm brad proprietor of barstool entertainment thank you for watching thank you for subscribing and thanks for stopping by.